Our reports of a fire outbreak at the Anglogan market. Uh, our correspondent Nana Bwachi Adam is there for us with the latest. If you can hear me, uh, Nana Bwachi, what can you report? So we are currently here at Anloga Market. Uh, this place is popularly known um, as the Anloga Market. Unfortunately, there is an outbreak just this morning over here with three buildings affected. You can see um, fire tenders trooping in and making sure that they are able to quench the fire. Uh, sad news for residents living here at Anloga, um, but fire tenders continue to troop in to make sure that they, they quench the fire and also make sure that everything goes on smoothly in the next hour or two. When I spoke to the fire officer, he told me that very soon they would be able to bring the fire down. But right now what I can report is that um, the unfortunate incident happened around uh, um, 10 a.m. and some three buildings have been affected. Fire attenders are in to make sure that everything is smooth. But uh, let me paint a picture of what is going on right here for you. You can see a number of people um, surrounded here on the street of Anloga. Uh, so sad, so unfortunate for them. People living in this, these buildings affected by the fire have been moved out. It is alleged that what led to the outbreak is a, is, is a gas explosion that led to the outbreak. That we cannot verify. We'll leave it to uh, fire attenders or fire officers here um, to make sure that the fire is down. But then people or residents in these three buildings have been moved out and then they are inside. I mean, fire attenders are inside to make sure that everything comes down smoothly in the next hour or two. But let's get interactive with some of these residents who witnessed what happened here at Anloga um, at around 10 a.m. this morning. Because <laughs> Okay, so he's explaining what led to the outbreak. He says that it started around 8.30. They tried calling in fire attenders, but they did not arrive on time, um, which led to the unfortunate uh, spread of the outbreak here this very morning. But then we should get, we should get, people to also speak to because they must explain to us what really led to the outbreak especially residents but then we still paint a picture to you of what led to the outbreak this morning or what um, things look like here at Anloga so a story building three story buildings have been affected and um, it is alleged that it is through a gas explosion that we witnessed this particular explosion but fire attendants are inside to make sure that everything comes down in the next hour or two that is according to the fire officer i spoke to earlier but they are still trying their best to make sure that the fire um, does not spread to other houses or other buildings but let's still get, let's get let's get people to talk to also so then i won't hear say i don't pay i don't pay the so i am you know you pay your first service, I just could see a crowd. I sent a crowd for Afra for no, and I was so no. I was saying, you're not the best me Afra had a red. I was saying, you're not the best me Afra had a red and Sana. Yes, I am more than a dear. I can't have a moment by and if you don't see. Okay, so he's also saying that if the fire service officers had arrived earlier, uh, they would not have the fire spreading this wide. But what you can see here, uh, some residents in the nearby house are trying to push the building um, to make sure that it does not spread into their house because the fire is still um, uh, ongoing. It's quite huge here. Fire tenders are not enough, but then they are also trying to help to make sure that everything goes on smoothly and then it, the fire does not really spread into their houses. Okay, so I have another person here with me. Oh, they tell me say, Anapano, around Ben 
Then we say, Jano, I started. Actually, the buyer says, yes, 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 yes.